The next kindergarten project that the children will be creating is traditional Kokeshi dolls. This is a special toy from Japan. Looks like a cute round wooden doll. These dolls are made with love and care by artists and Kokeshi dolls are usually, they have a simple body with a big head and a colorful painted clothes. Each doll is unique and has its own special design. Children in Japan love to collect and play with traditional Kokeshi dolls, and they bring lots of joy and smiles to everyone who sees them. This craft is something very special and the kids will love creating their Kokeshi doll. The parents who sign up for this project will require um, some prep work in advance. Basically a simple toilet paper tube will be covered with origami paper, which we will have cut to size and a hot glue gun will be used to glue that on very simply to glue it into place. And that will be the base, the body of the doll. The boys and girls can choose different pieces of pre-cut paper. The boys have a white tunic top and a belt made with origami paper, as well as the little pants for the boys. The children will be able to select a face in whatever skin tone the child would like. These will be pre-cut in advance. That will get glued to the top. And we also have pre-cut pieces of construction paper cut for the hair for the boys as well as the girls. The girls will use their covered body with the origami paper and we have strips of small origami paper to use for the sash. The children will use just simple markers to do the eyes and the face and red for the lips and we have labels to go on the back for the child's name. For the girls, we have some decorative flowers. Each child can select one flower to put in the, the girl's hair. And uh, these are very special. I know my children still have their Kokeshi dolls from when they were in kindergarten. So this, this is a very special project. Again, the parents will be using hot glue guns. We don't want the children to get anywhere close to the hot glue guns. The parents will be assisting the children to create their Kokeshi doll very carefully. And this should be completed within the 25 minute time frame. Um, again, it does require a lot of prep work, but I think the end result will be spectacular and we can display those as well. I would request that the parents who help with this project, please inventory, clean, and box up all of the supplies, and please deliver the box of supplies to the art room after the project has been finished. Thanks so much.